Hey there guys, my name's Hei Chen, welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to sideload any game from SideQuest without using SideQuest. And all you'll need is your Oculus Quest 2 headset right here, and your charging cable that you use to charge your Quest, and a USB-C to USB adapter right here, which should look something like this that you can go and get off Amazon for quite a cheap price. And obviously a laptop to be able to do this, because this does require a laptop. If you don't have a laptop, computer would be fine, either of them. The first thing that you're going to need to do is enable developer mode on your Oculus Quest. This might seem a bit complicated, but I'm going to break it down so it's nice and easy to understand. Because at first, I didn't understand it, but let's get into this. So all you need is to go onto your phone, and if you don't have the Oculus Quest app, download the Oculus app, sign in with your Oculus account, and all your stuff will be right there. So what you're going to want to do from there is going to go into settings on the actual app, then go on to advanced settings, so connect your quest from the device list to connect to it. Tap more settings which appears below your quest in the device list and then tap developer mode and then basically tap to switch to enable developer mode. So once you've got this downloaded onto your computer or PC, whatever you're using, you want to open that up and get that started. So when that gets opened up, here is what to do next. So what you're going to want to look for is this file right here, VR side loader for when it's going to be zipped. So you're going to want to use this right here to go and unzip the file or whatever software you want. Then it should look something like this when you go and click onto it. Then this application will be right here. You just want to double click on that and that's going to go and load up. So then what you're going to want to do after that is get your charging cable and your Oculus Quest to go and connect to your computer. So then once it's loading up onto your PC, you're going to see this right here, which you're going to want to click allow to be able to access. And then your Oculus Quest will be connected to your PC. Then once it's all set up right here, it should look something like this, where you can drag and drop your APK files into here. So then it will, the software right here will sideload any APK file, game or software you want to put onto your Quest 2 right through this. So it does say here, connect your device, enable developer mode, then drag and drop your APK below to sideload it. So then right here, what I usually do is just click it, get my file, and then it will start loading up. And then if it is successful, it will be green writing up here saying your APK file was successfully downloaded to your quest or sideloaded to your quest. Then right here, if you want to install anything, you can click this button right here. If you want to uninstall any of it, you can also use this application right here and we'll go through it. So if I click that, it will show all the APKs that I have downloaded and I can just choose any to go and uninstall if I wanted to. So I hope this was helpful. Let me know if this did work for you down below in the comment section below. So once you have done this and it has worked, all you need to do now is put your headset back on. You can disconnect your headset from your computer if you want to. And you're going to want to go to unknown sources. So where I'm clicking right over here. And then whatever APK you have decided to download, it will be right underneath there. So I hope this was helpful as I have already said. So as always, thank you so much for watching. My name's Hei Chen and I'll see you in the next one.